What is going on, Caferos? Welcome back to another video here. Today, today is the day we show you the Cafero household. It's gonna be amazing. I do have someone to shout out, and that is Simply Safe. Shout out to Simply Safe for sponsoring today's video. They're gonna be the security system that is on my house. The whole entire house is loaded with Simply Safe, and throughout this video, you're gonna see many of their products just placed all around the house. Simply Safe is an incredible home security system that is very, very efficient. Now, I play with a lot of the products as I am right now, and every single one of them is just so incredibly simple and easy to set up. This right here is literally, I click home, then this means I'm home right now. If anyone opens any doors with alarms or anything, there'll be professionals notified 24 seven that something is going on at this house. They'll call me. If I chose to put in a secondary number, they'll call that one if I don't answer. And then if no one answers, that's clearly there's something wrong and they'll call the cops and the cops will arrive to your house within minutes. Now I click off and uh, everything's good. I'm free to roam. I can open any doors and we're set. So if I left this door open, right? I'm just leaving it open. It is so thoughtful that it's gonna tell me to close the door if I forget it. Say it's even cracked open like this. It'll let me know eventually. It'll just say, front door open, you know? Just like that. I'm actually a pretty good voice for it. Front door open. Hey, what do you say? We'll show them this whole entire house, the outside first, of course, and then we'll get back to explain a little more of the Simply Safe and why I personally use it. Yeah, there's like five different keys for every door. I don't know. But we got the house key, and that's all that matters. We are actually on 2.82 acres, just about three acres. So whenever someone asks me how many acres I live on, I'm just going to say three. Fence is going in around this whole entire property, all three acres, and I will eventually have enclosures out here, tortoises, goats, mini horse, everything you can think of I want out here, especially when my mom comes out here because my mom does work for me now it's gonna be fun for her to come out play with the chickens and have all the fun that she used to have when she was a little girl because she she was always into the farm animals and we've never had the opportunity nor the land to do something like this we are on a canal we're on the corner of a canal so we have a canal along the whole right side and the canal on the whole back side bushes on this side bushes on the back we have no neighbors the only neighbors over there and we were ripping donuts in the front lawn yesterday <laughs> And uh, yeah, he came out and he's like, yo, that's so dope. But he is just super chill. So we got a really cool neighbor. That is, that is key. Get it, Nick. Right, wait, I'm gonna come around. Oh. Woo! Well, you can't do that in the suburbs, that's for sure. First things first, we're in the garage. It's a two car garage. We're gonna walk right through, as you can see, look at all the fishing rods just hanging up. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. We're gonna walk inside. Uh, Pop on the door and check it out. This is the kitchen. As you can see in the kitchen, it's pretty nice. New, modern, key, major key. I like the modern theme, as you can see. Got these little cool, uh, not sure what they are, but they look cool. Simply safe, of course, and this right here. Always gotta have the quotes around the house. Push harder than yesterday if you want a different tomorrow. As you can see, Luna's fish tank right here, our betta fish, a few uh, like neon tetras, placos in there as well. And it's just a really cool tank that I've had for the longest time ever. It's my oldest tank that I've had with the oldest fish that I've had inside of it. This right here is a cereal dispenser with no cereal in it. Really should have filled that up before this video because it really was, it looked cool when it was filled. There's our camera right there. Look at this thing. Wait, let's show ourselves. Look at this. Kitchen camera detected motion. And it says the date and what time it detected motion three minutes ago. And that is because this guy right here is a motion sensor. So watch how easy this is to pull up. Boom, boom, boom. And hey, oh wow, 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 echo, echo. Yo, so this, this lens is getting from right here, from right here, all the way, look at this, to here. Literally to right here. Take a look at that. That's us just chilling right there. Is that insane? Look how wide the lens is. It gets all the way to the living room back there. Everything, and that's just one camera right here. So dope. I cannot wait. I, I, I want to catch a robber now. Simply safe on. So one last further look of the kitchen here. Looks pretty nice. One, oh wait. Yeah, I filled that before the video too. Looks pretty cool, right? Gotta have the light blue Gatorades. So like I said, inside plans, we got a few plans. You just saw the kitchen and there's not much to do in the kitchen. I really do like how that looks. This wall, eventually get some artwork maybe. I know we got artwork coming from one of my friends that's going on that wall. We'll keep you updated on that later on. But uh, I also want to get like the new thermostat, like the new like, that one, not this like, I just want to rip it off right now, but I can't. We'll get that eventually. Uh, there's another positive quote. We also have a mini basketball court, it's pretty fun. I mean, I just cross up Nick. Nick literally never wins. And look at him. Shut He's up. never won a game. I just don't call Get him. Away from me. <laughs> <laughs> Quick 
up trick shot? Hey, okay. That's enough of the basketball. Big old closet here when you first walk in the front door. Boring. I actually redid all these tiles. Every single one of them. Got this like cool vinyl fake wood kind of look. Here is Susan, the Roomba. There she goes. Goodbye, Susan. One of the biggest projects we've done so far in this house is this right here. The 160 gallon fish tank was put into the wall, although this all is not painted gray yet. I want it to be a light gray. And then this will be white. This is just primer. And then it'll be like really popping out. Shout out to my mom's friend, Courtney, from Dewey's Designs. Made this super cool PC logo right here. It's all made out of wood. And the logo's just printed right into it. And I can just hang it. Inside this tank is all the fish that were in the 90 gallon fish tank. Tiger barbs, as you can see, giant Colombian tetras, rainbow sharks, iridescent catfish, quarry catfish, clown loach, lobsters, literally crayfish, like white crayfish down here, blue crayfish in the hole. I mean, there is just all sorts of fish. Now, one of the things I wanted to show for the longest time ever, and it's been hinted in the background as we built this right here, the living room, the chillest spot in the house. Ask Nick, I mean, look at him. This is a super dope, very big couch. Doesn't have recliners, but it is still dope. These things come up. Then we got like three lamps. Pretty cool. I mean, lamps produce light, much needed in a home at nighttime. And then of course, 75 inch 4K flat screen TV, which does not have the wires into the wall yet. So it still looks like it's just wires hanging everywhere. Eventually those will be in the wall and it'll look like this TV is literally floating. And then surround sound of course, and all my camera equipment's down there. So you're about to see the living room in like cinematic way, you know, where we do the little B-roll music. New, but Come on, Nick, unmute him. But it's gonna be really cool. I cannot wait. Like literally, that's all I gotta say. I, I can't wait. There's so much more to come. Nick, what are you laughing at, dude? <laughs> you muted me, dude. I know. It's it's fun. <laughs> So walking into the office here, this room is the back of the fish tank, which will eventually have white on the bottom of this fish tank right here. So all this right here will all be white. New cabinets will be on it. It'll look really nice and it'll look like it's just flush with the wall, you know? Just like the fish tank's just there. We got a little DJ setup. Who knows if I'll ever end up making like my own beats for the background music in my, I just bought it anyway, just to have it. This right here is my Madre works. Mom, I know you're watching. This right here is where all the business happens, you know? And uh, that's really it, but this room is kind of empty. I, there needs to be a futon, real quick. Much better. And we got a nice little fluffy pillow here. So, cup holders, this folds up, and uh, we got ourselves a futon. Eventually we get a rug. And then this right here, which holds like towels and whatever you want to hold in there. We'll go right in the middle, almost as if it's like a nice footrest, you know? All right, that's pretty dope. So futon's in the office now, looks good. Got a lot of fan art to um, hang up here. We're gonna do this whole entire room in the fan art. If you wanna send any art, send it to the PO box linked in the description. And it'll definitely be on this wall right here with all the other artwork, uh, but uh, that's the office. This is the guest room, just not quite yet. There's no furniture in here. Uh, this, as you can see, Bubba has torn it up. I usually keep it neat with uh, this folded. So this is George, my flower horn. By far, the most personality I've ever seen in a fish is this little guy right here. I mean, look at him. He's just playing with my finger. Hey, let's feed him real quick. Woo! <laughs> As you can see, this futon is obviously comfortable. Nick's already sleeping on it, and it's only been about five minutes. Nick, you good, bro? All right, I'm setting the alarm, so you're good. You're safe in here, okay? Mm -hmm. I clicked home. Anyone mm -hmm. comes in, house will be here within a minute. All right, enough of Nick sleeping. We're actually gonna show you the bathrooms. We're getting into the bathrooms now. Of course not. Hey, hey, hey! He was just sleeping. I've been waiting a while to show you this one. This is my room right here. Pretty dope. This is where I get ready in the morning. Not that I really get ready. I just kind of do my hair real quick and uh, throw some clothes on and that's really it. Self-trust is the first secret of success. We got motivational quotes all around this house. You just kind of got to peek them out. Here's Lisa. This is Llama Lisa. I don't know if you know who she is. She's beautiful, absolutely stunning. She's the first thing that greets you when you walk into my room. So let me just show you how it looks when you walk in. There she is. Beautiful specimen. This right here behind you is actually something really cool that my aunt and uncle got me as well as Dominic, my cousin. It's a really cool wall art. As you can see, these are koi fish. And I guess this is just like mimics like some sort of modern 
circular sphere that's on the wall. It just looks really cool when the koi fish is like going upstream, you know? This is my bed, and the best part about this bed is how you can just play games, like video games. Once that TV right there, see that TV? It's gonna be up on the wall up there. We haven't even got the closet done or anything yet. It's gonna be really cool, but you can just put this all the way up, and just like that, see, see? And you can put your feet up too. That's a big perk. Big perk, but that's pretty cool. Now on to the bathroom. The bathroom's pretty nice. Definitely need to redo this shower right here, as you can tell, like, I mean, it's not the, in the nicest shape. It's not bad, but it's not in the nicest shape and stuff just like kind of falls apart. But that's what I like to do. I like like doing this kind of thing. As you can see, we got like shampoo, conditioner, body wash. This right here is like a toothpaste dispenser. So I'm into all these like little tiny gadgets. Not sure if you know, but that's pretty cool. <laughs> that is cool. So you just put your toothbrush right in there. It dispenses your toothpaste. And then after you're done, and then right here, flip this up and hang your toothbrush. Keeps it, you know, makes it dry, nice. But other than that, this is my bathroom. Pretty nice, bathroom, bedroom. This right here is the bathroom. Haven't done much to this bathroom whatsoever. Like, as you can see, there's literally nothing. What the heck? Yo, you were just sitting. Can I get some that's, privacy? That's the bathroom right there. Hey. Not much going on, I turned the lights off. Now you may ask, after seeing some of this house, you may say, Paul, why do you want this security in particular? Now, one reason, my parents are beyond protective. You know, like, hey, you're out there in the middle of nowhere, you better have security. Now, another reason is because when you have security, you can leave the house and not have to worry. Me personally, I have a lot of electronics, I have my pigs in here, I have a ton of stuff that's very valuable. And in order for me to feel safe leaving my home, especially leaving here for like days and on end on a vacation to California, wherever I may travel to, having a live cam in my kitchen, in my living room, all the doors and windows have the sensors on them, you feel much more safe. Now a lot of the times you get these little hidden fees and you have to sign contracts, so on and so forth. There's no contracts, no hidden fees, nothing. Straight up fair and honest prices. This right here is equipped for the worst case scenario possible. This is actually really easy to set up and look at these tiny little, these go on all your windows and your doors. Let's do that real quick. Something really cool is this is how tiny the sensors are. So all you gotta do is this, boom, and it's in place. Just like that, it takes three seconds. This right here is an old alarm system. And look at it, it's glued, it's huge, it's yellow. It's not good looking. That right there, real slick, real modern, real cool. And for how tiny that is, it does the same job as that would. And that is obviously much more better looking. That's that. I mean, it's a three bedroom, two bath, perfect size home for my, myself and whoever wants to eventually live here with me if it's just a friend or a roommate or whatever it may be. We're chilling, we're having fun, it's awesome. We got three acres to do whatever the heck we want on this property. And uh, I'm about to show you outside. We haven't done much, so keep in mind there's a lot, a lot to do. But I'm gonna show you some of the ideas I have and uh, what has been done so far. That right there is the glass detector. So if someone breaks the glass, <laughs> yeah. This right here is the turtle pool pond. Pretty simple. There is peacock bass in here, tiger shovel nose in here, a ton of turtles. Let me just give you a quick look. This snapping turtle, raptor, check him out. Such a beautiful, beautiful turtle. And uh, he's gonna get huge, of course. But uh, let's get him back, put him right back in his hole that he was in. There you go, buddy. And uh, this right here is the pool the house came with. It's just a fiberglass pool that's in the ground. You can easily pop it out of the ground, and we will be popping it out of the ground with the team aquascape coming shortly to do a rec pond just like Camp Kennan just had done in his house. It's, I shouldn't say shortly because it's going to happen about a year from now, but within the next year, this will be a massive 30 by 60, 40 by 80, whatever we may do, the designers are going to come and do that. It's going to be insane, just let's say that. Alrighty, now outside of this cruddy gate that will be redone eventually, is this pool pond. This right here is where the catfish will go, all my red tail catfish that are at my parents' house right now. And this right here, it's all three acres of beautiful green grass. It's gonna be even more greener when the irrigation guy comes tomorrow. That was an expensive bill. But it's gonna be amazing. And uh, all these trees are from the previous owner. He loved trees, a lot of fruit trees. The star fruits out there, mangoes, lemons, oranges. There's everything you can think of out there. And uh, I'm gonna keep them all. Not all of them in that exact place. I might just replant them somewhere else, but I do like fruits and why not have fresh fruit right in your backyard, am I right? One of the worst parts about living out here where it's so dry and especially without irrigation is this right here. Let me show you. 
this toy gun. I'm just gonna pop it out of the ground and watch how many red ants come out. I mean, yo, dude, that that's that's insane. That is what happened. All I did was make a little hole. I mean, look, this ant pile is absolutely huge. I mean, look how big it is. So there's a lot of those on the property. We're gonna get that solved eventually, though. And uh, a lot of eventually is because, like I said, I just moved into here. I wasn't even prepared to make a video like this just yet. We're gonna have all sorts of videos upcoming on this channel about how this this whole this whole house is gonna literally evolve into another place, another land. This is all gonna be animals and enclosures and super cool stuff, making videos out in the canal, getting a jet ski, having so much fun, it's unreal. So if you have not done so already, I encourage you, please do hit that subscribe button, hit it with a fist. It is free, right down there below. And after doing that, you can click the bell, which will then notify you every time I do upload, which is every other day. And uh, I'm extremely blessed to have the opportunity to produce content, do what I love, and have such amazing home to create content in. So I appreciate every single one of you for watching. The house tour is finished. Simply Safe is protecting my home. And if you want Simply Safe to protect your home, all you gotta do is go to the link in the description, or you can go to simplysafe.com slash Paul. That's all you gotta do. It's right down there in the description. Click that for me. One last huge thank you. Life safe.